Welcome to another episode of Trophy Stupid Vlog. Boo, we're back in Gatwick. The reason you know we're in Gatwick, or near Gatwick, is because here's the Sky Bridge. This means we are less than half an hour from our baggage. <laughs> if it's here. If it, if it actually made it this time. I think it wants to catch up because it missed a day. <laughs> so it's actually going to spend another day in Venice just so everything works out. I can't believe they put us out the end of the sky bridge. That's where all the, the sleazy jet people go. That's where we went for we flew easy jet to Marrakesh. Shocking. Oh well. We'll be there at some point. There we go, I have paper to look like I now use my English sim. This is the shuttle goes a trillion miles an hour to the train station. Now, thank you to the nice lady at the currency exchange who gave me a paperclip so I can actually speak to English people. Otherwise I'll be stuck on Italian sim for weeks. Got any corners aggressively, this thing. Good morning. It's walk-in day because uh, I have to work a bit late at work, so this is the payoff. Now look at that, hasn't been that misty since November, it's a pea super, as they say in London. I can hear boats, I just can't see them, this one. It's supposed to be a beautiful day today, <laughs> I'm still waiting, let's see. It's actually cloud leaving the water. I think the problem is the air temperature is really hot and yet the water temperature is really cold. So it's a bit confused the weather. And if you look that way, see that's kind of nearly blue. So I'm optimistic. I woke up this morning and you have that feeling sometimes when you can almost feel the heat preemptively. Like you know today's going to be a really, really warm day. That's what I had this morning. So either I'm mad or the weather forecast's wrong. Or it is going to be nice, we're just going to have to wait a bit. These people I have a crazy. Why would you do that? I don't understand. Anyway, I thought I'd give a little commentary on uh, coming back from Venice, uh, which is amazing. Uh, every single cliche you've ever heard is true. It's a fantastic place, you have to go. Um, <laughs> it's hard to imagine a city that is almost floating in the middle of a lagoon um, but it is fantastic I'm now desperate to go back it's the first time I've been to Italy since 2004 which is <laughs> too long <laughs> I might end up going back this year you know how it is you suddenly go yeah no I'm, I need to go there again look at all this cloud can you see that maybe you don't have enough megapixels that's your fault so anyway yes I am hoping to uh, to go back there again soon. It's far nicer than being in London with its confusing, <laughs> very confusing weather. There we go, it's another Friday and Neil has cake. Ah, yeah, hi. Uh, you probably remember me from last week's episode. <laughs> I was stuffing myself with ribs. Yes, that's well, the result. I've, I've recovered. <laughs> um, now I'm, I'm not going to do it on camera, but I feel like we're going to be stuffing ourselves with cake. Um, and I can see Russ come in. <laughs> he, he's the king of cake. If you um, say cake in front of Russ, I don't know how to get into these. I think it's... You're just shit. This is embarrassing. Oh, Open no, the box. Really. Sorry. They're from a company called Sweet Good. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oreo Russ. cakes. Oreo cakes. What? Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's Russ, king of cakes. That is the reaction I was looking oh, for. Oh, come on, look at that. That just been delivered to me. Yeah. Beauty. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, so, thank you very much to Joe Pyle. Brilliant. 